Yo, what is up guys? So, we have a lot of news. So many things is going on right now in the classic WoW and in general just in the WoW scene. Quite ridiculous. I'm gonna jump over here real fast. Whee! Because you guys can see a little bit better. So, we have a lot of news like Wrath Beta obviously is out and um, a lot of blue posts in regards to classic WoW Wrath announcements right here. We have a blue post in regards to the new Dungeon Finder, which a lot of you guys have probably know about. And it's a very heated debate in terms of what would you want, what wouldn't you want. A lot of people really want the autofill system where you just queue up and you get a random group. But as it stands right now, the current iteration of what they have designed for the Wrath Classic release is like a little bit of a system in similar to the current one we have in retail, where you can sign up for a group and then you can put yourself into a um, into a waiting list and people can look through the list and then also message you and so on and so forth, right? But let's look at the blue post here, guys, and see what this is all about and uh, we can see what you guys think about it and I'll share my thoughts a little bit about it as well. As we all know, there's an infinite amount of ground to cover on this topic, but I'm not sure how much I can say that has already been said before. But I can assure you that our team's extremely committed to finding good solutions to player concerning that don't compromise to things that make classic loved in the first place. And speaking of solutions, we've come bearing some good news. We are actively developing a brand new group finder UI for Wrath of the Lich King Classic Here's a small pack preview of some of the features we're aiming to deliver. New look, modern code. We built the UIs to be easier to read and more inviting than it was in Burning Crusade Classic behind the scenes. We're using more modern group finder code, ensuring stability and performance. So at the moment, how it looks like, uh, I will, after we read this blue post, guys, I will log into the beta and I will show you guys how it actually looks like. But basically, it looks like the, the modern version of the current... Um, of the group finder that you can find in retail with a little bit of a different design, right? So imagine a looking for group bulletin board that we have in retail right now, the add-on that everybody uses and hates, but actually a usable version that could be a little bit better. Um, it is not an automated queue system where you just get a random assigned group as we did in Late Wrath, but regardless, it's what we currently have. Okay, we're introducing uh, roles into the UI in Wrath Classic. Partial groups can broadcast which slots they have open, and individuals can specify whether they're willing to tank, heal, or deal damage, or do multiple of the above. Roles are intended to expedite communication, not stifle gameplay creativity. So for the moment, we're keeping all roles open to all classes. Okay, uh, obviously there's a few things that, you know, like obviously a warrior can't heal and so on and so forth, but that's a minor thing. Something that's going to get changed, hopefully, and we'll see. Solar listings and multiple activities. We envision the group finder as a bulletin board. Exactly like exactly like the bulletin board in, in, in TBC, the add-on, right? That kind of sucks and lags the game. Where players can list activities they want to do and discover others who want to do the same. So that end, we're supporting listings from both solo individuals and partially filled groups. And if you can't decide which dungeon you want to run, that's okay. You can list yourself from more than one. I like that. In terms of an auto, like a non-automated system... Um, I actually really like the current iteration that there is in the classic beta. Uh, I do think it could be quite nice having an automated one as well, and I, and I think a lot of people would like to agree with that too. But um, we'll see down the road whether or not they're going to decide to actually add that or not. And let me know what you guys think, by the way, in the comments. If you think they should add one, like an automated system, or if you like the current one that they have on the beta. Obviously, I will show you guys at the end, so stay tuned for that. To smooth out uh, formation, we're adding request invite and suggest invite features. Just remember a quick hey there. It's always preferred over a silent and sudden ninja invite, obviously, yeah. The single source for your group finding needs. We're aiming for this group finding UI to be a, this one-stop shop for all your group finding needs. To that end, we're, relieving, we're reviving an old rule from the original Burning Crusade and Wrath of the Lich King. Um, sending messages in the grouping, in the looking for group chat channel will require being listed in the UI. Okay. You might be thinking, no one likes restrictions. In an ideal world, each individual player would build up their groups using whatever tool they seem the best for the job. However, we observe that group finding is a social coordination problem and there's value in funneling everybody through the same system. We can create a single source through all group finder is done. All players will recap, uh, read the benefits. So this is how it looks like, um, the, the screenshots, like you have the general like UI, obviously. You can pick the things you wanna sign up for. And then you can you can you can sign up for that, um, add a little note about yourself, uh, and then group up for it. And then they will show up as a group as seen below here. 
Um, so basically, it is a very modern version of the Looking for Group Bulletin Board, where you can you can see how big the group is, how much they filled up, and you can add a little note to which you would like to to invite people and join. I honestly think it's it 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 looks nice. I really like the way that this looks, but I'm a little bit apprehensive in, in in regards to the if it's if we need an auto automated one or not, right? A lot of people really would like an automated one, and I do think it could also be good. One thing that's that's very um, big about this is that it's probably gonna be uh, there's gonna be a lot of boosting people here, right? So whether or not it's something we can do something against, obviously we'll have to see. But there's definitely gonna be a lot of boosting listed here, right? Like gold gold boosting or like whatever, and uh, and level level and stuff and stuff like that, right? Um, but we'll have to see what's going to happen in regards to that. Uh, I'm going to log in right now, guys, in the beta so you guys can see how it works in action. Um, obviously, there's not going to be a lot of people online in the beta, unfortunately, since it's very early access. But I will show you guys how the general idea of the UI does look. Uh, and you can, you can get an idea of what uh, you can expect from it. So I'm on my warrior right now on the beta. Obviously, you can see here there's a bunch of glyphs. We got all these things here. Uh, but how the looking for group system looks like at the current version is like this. So basically, we have the dungeons, uh, which we can click here. We see all the dungeons we can sign up for at level 70 currently. You can sign up as a tank, DPS, and healer. This is probably going to get removed for the, for the people that, that can't heal. Um, so if you want to do it, you, you choose a raid. Let's say I want to sign up for a dungeon. I click all the dungeons I would like to sign up for. I type... I'm a very good DPS, smiley face, and I list myself, and I will be listed like this. And there's actually another person right here. So right here, you can see another person here that's, that's, that's listing right. So like, if I wanted to join this, I could message him or I can group invite him. So I think in of itself, this feature and the way that this UI looks like, I personally like it. I think it does look really good. Um, do we need some sort of an automated system where you just queue up and you get an automated um, invite? That could be something we should definitely look into. And I do think that a lot of people would like that, right? Instead of searching for groups, um, there's an automated system as well. You could argue for there, there being an, uh, like uh, availability for both. So we both have a, a system where you can just sign up for a random one. And there's also a looking for more, like in retail, right? So this would be the looking for more, and then there would be like a uh, basically like an automated system that's a looking for group. I think that could be kind of cool, but uh, regardless though guys, that's the current iteration of the beta looking for group system, looking for dungeon system, and so on and so forth. Let me know what you guys think about it, and um, make sure to leave a, leave a like on the video, and sub if you would like, if you enjoyed the content. But uh, I'll see you guys in the next one.